Today, I'm going to be joining the real world by Andrew Tate, but more specifically, the freelancing campus in the real world. I'm going to go through the entire course and make as much money as possible from everything I learn. Firstly, I'm going to have to buy the real world, which costs $49 a month. I entered the server and joined the freelance campus section and straight away started going through all the information that they teach in this course. This is inside the real world. Tate himself speaking. You can ask Tate questions. Over here on the left hand side you can choose a skill. Now I chose what was freelancing but now is called client acquisition. And once you come to the course section of this client acquisition section there's so many different courses. So you can start from this mindset, client acquisition, there are different videos here. Phase one it's about learning a skill, building your socials, harness Instagram, Twitter, LinkedIn, Facebook, how to use all of these. Okay so the first step I have to do is pick a skill. Then I I have to create a portfolio to find clients then set my rates from there you fulfill you get paid after the job is done and that's it for the skill that I'm going to pick it's going to be landing pages because I'm pretty good at copywriting and I have a knack for design the step now is to establish a freelancing portfolio this is just a collection of your best work that you can show as expertise I went to card and paid for it and it's only ten dollars a year from there I was able to make my own landing page on that and I put the best quality images of other landing pages that I had built on this as proof of work. I wanted to show potential clients that I could create a landing page for them that is nice. So firstly, I decided to build one for myself that was nice. Next, I started doing upreach on Upwork and Fiverr. And to be honest, there's not a whole pile of difference between these two. I hadn't experienced either of them until now. But Fiverr, there seems to be more opportunities on, but the quality on Upwork seems to be better on. Not everything was sunshine and rainbows. I went through all of Andrew Tate's course and after getting my first client, I failed to get another. They wouldn't give me a testimonial. They were just controlling everything that I did and I had no choice but to move on from it. So again, I was literally left with nothing. But whereas if I'd done this with a personal brand, let's say on X or Twitter, I could have posted about my journey about doing this page for a client, the process of it, how I wrote the copy, how I built the page itself and how I even onboarded the client. So I have seen so many other people doing this on X and it just seemed to make sense to me. So I did so much outreach on Twitter and unfortunately I just still didn't land a client. It just didn't seem like it was working out for me at all. I'm not going to lie, it was tough. It felt bad. I felt almost a pain in my chest. But instead of competing with thousands of other people on platforms like Upwork, Fiverr and even Twitter, you just have to create content. So document the process of your learning and post all of it and put it all out there. This was like another epiphany for me and I was like damn I can actually put content out there and people will follow me and actually like me for me. And plus the thing is I'm going to be able to charge 10x more on Twitter. So I got some help from coaches inside the real world and how to actually post content. I was able to come up with a content strategy, what I needed to post on every single day and how to actually attract an audience and attract clients. Then I started posting more content and sending more DMs. As my account was growing, I started getting more inbound DMs asking about my services, which was kind of crazy because just recently I was on Upwork and Fiverr and couldn't get anything at all. So using my own methods and methods from the real world, I was able to actually combine all these skills and get a thousand followers in just 15 days. Then I had people reaching out to me looking to work with me and I was able to take up deals and opportunities. And from there, I landed a client and they paid me $2,000 for a landing page. They're in the fitness niche and they needed a landing page as soon as possible. They told me they wanted a modern style, but that was packed with social proof and client results. And they kind of wanted it like Dan Go's website. We did this because Dan is making a lot of money online through his landing page. He's built so much trust with his audience and has over half a million followers. So I did a client interview with this client and went through everything that he might need. So any copywriting that he has, any images he has, testimonials branding colors. These are the main points you need when actually building a landing page for a client and doing the copywriting. From there, I went and 
did my market research people like Dan Go again and so many other fitness guys that are making a killing online next up was creating the copy and perfecting it I brought so many different landing pages together of people that are doing a similar thing to my client and selling a similar product to my client but I was able to perfect it and hit the pain points of the market because I'd done that research and once I had all the copy complete I was able to do the design and I literally used like YouTube and Google to have a nice template and look at different pages again that had really beautiful design and this was a sweet spot for me that I was able to perfect so I got the client's page ready within six days I simply asked him then for a video testimonial and he sent it to me straight away because I had done such a good job and got it to him early and fulfilled very very well he was willing to do this testimonial for me a week later due to this testimonial I landed another client for two and a half thousand dollars from there I repeated the cycle and did a client interview got all the information I needed then went away and did market research to make sure I had the pain points so I could then write the copy and following that I was able to do it more design on a page and follow certain templates that made my life so easy so how much did I make from going through Andrew Tate's real world course drum roll please four thousand five hundred dollars it was actually proof andrew tate's real world does work if you follow all the steps i have a personal brand on twitter with over thirty thousand followers and i make about 20k per month freelancing it's important to pick a skill that you enjoy and that makes sense for you to work on but constantly seek feedback stay competitive and you will make money having said all this as someone who is able to quit their nine to five in 90 days and make over 10 10k a month freelancing and also have made over 100k in the last year i can honestly say yes this course is super beneficial for beginners but then the question is how do you actually get to that stage of making money if the real world isn't able to assist you enough and get you to that point whatever your age gender location skill set knowledge i'm going to help you make money and build your career as a freelancer so with that being said hit the subscribe button below hit this video here where i reveal the steps on how you can start making money by freelancing thanks for watching i hope you enjoyed take care